This Sunday is World Leprosy Day. Here to tell us a little bit more about leprosy and neglected tropical diseases and how they still affect our world is CEO of Effect Hope Canada, Kim Evans. Good morning. Good morning, Todd. Kim, tell us a little bit more about what neglected tropical diseases are. Neglected tropical diseases are a group of life-limiting diseases of poverty, like leprosy, that affect 1.5 billion people worldwide. That's one in six people across the globe have one or more of the neglected tropical diseases. Uh, They're caused by uh, things like viruses, bacteria, and uh, parasites, Um, and most of them can be prevented. When you say leprosy, for me, you know, I thought that was something of the past. I didn't think that was even around in the world anymore. Well, Todd, unfortunately, that's not true. Um, leprosy, um, while it, it may have been reported in scripture uh, every day right now, 600 people are diagnosed with leprosy um, in some of the world's poorest communities. And of those 600, um, 50 of them are children. For example, I can tell you a story of of Jocelyn, a a 12-year-old girl, who found a a lesion on her skin. And she she went to the local village clinic, um, was diagnosed with leprosy, and received timely treatment and care. But her story is unique because lots of times people don't recognize leprosy. She recognized it because her grandfather had leprosy. And because he recognized the importance of getting early uh, diagnosis, treatment, and care, he ensured that she did so that she would not have to suffer the same disability, permanent um, disabilities that he suffered. Because untreated leprosy causes disabilities, disfigurement, blindness, and real rejection from family and community. There's a lot of stigma still attached to leprosy. People are afraid of what they don't know anything about. Mm. And one of the things that Effect Hope works to do is to is to make people aware um, of, of leprosy and to understand what they can do about it. Kim, tell us a little bit more about World Leprosy Day. Yes, World Leprosy Day started um, as a day for Christian action back in 1953. Actually, um, it's on January 31st. And effectively, we are raising awareness about the suffering of of billions of people affected by both leprosy and other neglected tropical diseases. We want to give a voice to the voiceless. This year is unique in that we're not just celebrating World Leprosy Day. We're also celebrating Neglected Tropical Diseases Day, um, which was added, again, to bring more awareness to other neglected tropical diseases like leprosy. On January 31, in fact, the CN Tower um, and other iconic monuments around the world will be lit up as orange to raise awareness for neglected tropical diseases. And there is a cure for leprosy. It's treatable, isn't it? That's true. There's a complete cure for leprosy if we get it early enough. Okay. Where can people go to get more information about what Effect Hope does to fight leprosy around the world? Sure. So they can go to uh, www.effecthope.org slash life or life FM and uh, to learn about the ways they can be involved. They can help us spread a word. Uh, They can pray for people living with the disease. Pray that there might be a solution for them in the days ahead. They can sign up for our prayer letter um, and they can donate. Again, www.effecthope.org slash life. Um, For $45 a month, they can help provide a cure and complete care for someone with leprosy. Uh, For $35 a month, they can provide hand or foot surgery for a person with disability from a neglected tropical disease. Kim Evans is the CEO of Effect Hope. And again, the website, effecthope.org. Thanks, Kim. Thank you.